a prototype of Torso, an anthropomorphic musculoskeletal robot designed by engineers at the Polish firm Clone, mimics the structure of the human torso. The robot features anthropomorphic shoulders with scapulothoracic, acromioclavicular, glenohumeral, and sternoclavicular joints, two arms with movable elbows, and hands with fingers. Artificial hydraulic muscles with a valve matrix in the chest region power the robot's body. In addition to tilting and rotating its head, the robot can move its arms. The control system of the robot is currently being trained by engineers to manipulate objects with both hands. The project's objective is to build a humanoid robot that functions similarly to the natural elements of the human body. Engineers have been working on creating a bionic robotic hand until recently. The tension of artificial hydraulic muscles based on McKibben actuator designs moves every component of the hand. These muscles are made up of a stretchy, airtight tube inside a braided sleeve. The tube expands in breadth as it fills with liquid or gas. However, the entire actuator contracts in length, simulating muscle activity, because the outer sleeve hardly expands. For instance, a set of 18 kilograms kettlebells may be held in place by clone's bionic hand thanks to its strong grip. The humanoid robot race continues. China's X-Engine AI recently unveiled its first full-size, versatile humanoid robot called Southeast Zero One. Developed with a focus on practical applications, this robot is designed to perform a wide range of tasks across various sectors, from industrial manufacturing and services to education and scientific research. Southeast Zero One is equipped with 12 degrees of freedom in its joints, allowing for flexible movements like squats and push-ups. This capability enables it to perform physically demanding tasks while remaining stable and maneuverable. X Engine AI, founded in 2023 and based in Shenzhen, is composed of robotics experts, many of whom have experience from top universities like UC Berkeley and Tsinghua. The company's primary goal is the development of versatile robots with potential for commercialization and broad deployment. Here is a unique training process of a large group of mini cheetah robot dogs developed in MIT's laboratory. Each of these small robots weighs around 9 kilograms and is designed to mimic the fast, smooth movements of animals like cheetahs. Equipped with three powerful motors on each leg, the robots can perform complex maneuvers, sharp turns, self-correcting jumps upon landing, and even backflips. In the video, you can see the synchronized movements of nine robots, demonstrating precise coordination and an efficient decentralized control system where each robot independently adjusts its position and adapts to changes in real time. MIT uses advanced reinforcement learning algorithms to train the robots in a virtual environment, allowing them to learn from various scenarios before deployment in real conditions. This approach minimizes human intervention as the robots adapt independently to new conditions, like slippery surfaces, maintaining balance even in challenging situations, Limex Dynamics has developed an innovative robot called t one in one the world's first multimodal bike the robot capable of switching movement modes based on surface type. The robot can be controlled in real time via a wireless remote or autonomously through Python programming. Standing 85 centimeters tall and weighing around 20 kilograms, it can operate for up to 1.5 hours on a single charge. Additional ports allow for the connection of various peripheral devices, such as cameras, litters, and manipulators. Tron 1's modular design enables it to adapt easily to different terrains, including uneven surfaces, smooth floors, and challenging areas with obstacles. This adaptability makes Tikoron N1 not just a robot, but a full-fledged platform for research and experimentation, where flexibility and high maneuverability are essential. The company A Robot has introduced its new humanoid robot named Alice V4, designed to perform tasks closely resembling human behavior. Alice V4 stands 136 centimeters tall and weighs about 20 kilograms. It features 20 degrees of freedom in its movements, allowing it to execute complex tasks with precision and smooth motion. The robot can interact with people through facial recognition, speech and gesture recognition technologies, providing a positive user experience thanks to its friendly interface and design that promotes a robot's natural perception. Its capabilities include recognizing an objects, as well as analyzing its environment, enabling it to navigate a soccer field, track the ball, and even kick it, showcasing a high level of autonomy. 
Our robot aims to create a robot that can become reliable assistant, interacting with humans as naturally as possible. Very soon robots may fully replace baristas, offering users quick, accurate, and high-quality service. One such example is the Xbot Coffee Robot, an autonomous barista robot capable of making a variety of coffee drinks, from classic espresso to complex lats, in just 70 to 90 seconds. Designed with the needs of modern mini cafes in mind, Xbot offers personalized beverages and convenience, making coffee breaks more tech-driven and accessible. The robot is equipped with an AI system and a touchscreen, allowing it to take orders, adjust recipes to customers' tastes, and maintain consistent quality. With its compact design and ability to operate autonomously, the Xbot Coffee Robot is perfect for high-traffic areas where fast and reliable drink service is essential. Specialists at Disney Research Labs have developed a tel-operated robot whose manipulators are powered by hydraulics and pneumatics. The robot is equipped with two manipulators, each with four degrees of freedom and a pair of cameras mounted on a rotating head. Each manipulator uses four identical hydraulic cylinders, which can operate with regular water as the hydraulic fluid. The VR goggles and a specialized controller are used by the operator to control the robot. The developers claim that TEL-operated robots that employ hydraulics and pneumatics can replicate the movements of their operators more accurately than those that use cables. The robot's operator may be seen in a demonstration video playing a xylophone, moving a chicken egg, threading a needle, and even playing patty cake. Engineers at ETH Zurich have improved the robot AnyMile to enable it to scale vertical ladders. Specialized C-shaped end effectors were used in place of the robot's conventional legs so that it could hold the steps firmly and stay stable while climbing. The scientists used an eye-based training approach since these end effectors would be useless if the robot didn't know how to use them. 90% of the time in laboratory tests, the upgraded AnyMall with its new software was able to climb ladders with inclines ranging from 70 to 90 degrees. Furthermore, compared to previous bipedal or quadrupedal robots that could accomplish comparable tasks, its climbing pace was 230 times faster. After watching this video, let us know what you enjoyed most in the comments section. View our earlier videos as well.